What's up everyone and welcome back to another video on the Long Life YouTube channel. If you're not already a subscriber, be sure to hit that subscribe button and click the notification bell so that way you get notifications on your smart devices anytime that a new video is released so that way you don't miss anything. On today's video, we're going to talk about polling. trailer um, for for me coming from this is my parents coach for me coming from something like that that weighs 40,000 pounds on oh man eight airbags uh, it took a lot for me to get comfortable uh, to drive in this and that so I went from that to this here so for, for me, it took quite a bit, uh, for me, it took quite a bit to get used to the transition to go from something like that to pulling once again. I've never owned a trailer before. Uh, I say a trailer because it is a travel trailer. I've had nothing but driving motorhomes. Anyways, today we're going to talk about pulling. So I'm in no form, way, or anything sponsored by this company. Um, I paid full price for this item that I'm getting ready to show you guys. And uh, for me, I have a lot of testing that I've done myself with two different hitches. So we're going to talk about a hitch. It's called the shocker hitch. And the first shocker hitch I had was with a weight distribution hitch. And I tried that one. And we did a lot of testing with that one. And then um, I switched to just a, a normal bumper hitch, if you will, that's got the airbag and uh, i'm going to go over my thoughts with both of them like i said i'm not in any form sponsored by this company i will say that they have excellent customer service uh, anytime that i've reached out phone calls emails i would highly recommend this product it's built very good is the shocker hitch and no i'm not talking the shocker but it's called the shocker so anyways this one here has got the, uh, the sway control on it for, I already had the bracket on there for the trailer for the, for the sway brake. So um, how it works here is you've got an airbag that rides on the bottom side of this receiver. And then here's your Schrader valve that you actually put in your air. There's a small line that goes underneath into this airbag. So up here you've got two two bump cushions. The black one's a harder material, the green one's a, a softer material. And when you get the trailer down on this, you'll get in between your soft zone and this will push down on, it'll actually pivot. So it'll actually push down and then it'll actually compress this bag. There's a grease circle over here, right there, and that's your actual pivot point. So like I said, when you put the weight of the tongue on there and depending on depending on the, the weight of the trailer and whatnot, you have to adjust your, your air pressure to get it in between the, you know, the soft zone there. So this will actually just go and just kind of pivot like that. Um, and then it's the, it's the coolest deal. It really is. Um, it completely changes the ride on pulling this trailer. Now this is a 25 foot Airstream. Um, before I had a weight distribution hitch on it and uh, for I think for this particular truck this is a one ton dually for this truck I don't think it was I just don't think it was the right combination I think it's about finding the right combination and that's why uh, I bobbed from shocker hitch uh, he called me several times and was excellent to deal with and we talked back and forth about pressures chain tension all sorts of stuff um, him and i so i was super impressed with how he reached out and he's i think the founder or whatever or the engineer or whatnot so i was super impressed with that that he took the time and 
was trying to get it figured out because I just with this particular truck I think it's too big of a truck with a weight distribution hitch that it wasn't maybe with a half ton where you're putting a lot more on the truck I think that is the better option where this one I I didn't have very much tension on the on the bars and so I don't think there was enough enough tension loading that particular hitch so we tried that hitch for like two weekends um did it improve ri the, the ride absolutely do i need a weight distribution hitch for this truck no i had it before with my three quarter ton and i figured oh, i'd use it for this but i can contest that we put this hitch on and it is absolutely fantastic i would recommend this hitch to anybody that owns a trailer anybody um it's just amazing. This has got the flip ball, so this is two and five sixteenths, and that's two. That's two inch, so you can you can flip that around. Um, but I don't care if it's not necessarily just a, even a travel trailer. It could be, it could be a, any any trailer. Um, huge difference on the ride quality uh, on the truck. You don't get the bang 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 anymore. Um, now that we don't have the weight distribution hitch and it's riding on this one, I can actually watch the in my in my mirrors as i'm driving right here in this section when i watch it down the horizon um, when we go over like bridges and stuff i can actually see it almost looks like a boat in water i can see how soft and smooth it is on the front of the airstream um with the right of it so it's just kind of gets on that hitch in that bag and you can see where it just kind of bobs there like a boat in water. So I know that the ride in the trailer has gotta be way, way better. Um, in the truck, you can, it's just so much, it's like riding on pillows. It's, it's fantastic. Um, I absolutely love, love this hitch. Uh, I think it's a great product. Like I said, looking at the welds, the welds are just super massive, you know, good, good penetrating heat, you know, um, just, big 3 8 plate or something huge you know i mean everything grade 8 bolt it's just a greaser i mean it's just an amazing an amazing hitch um you know so anyways i wanted to talk about the shocker air hitch and basically tell everybody my my thoughts of you know the pros and the cons and and all that so so that's my thoughts on the shocker hitch I highly recommend it. It's an amazing product. Um, I'd like to thank everybody for watching another one of our videos. If you guys have any comments, be sure to place them down below. If you guys like this video, hit the thumbs up. If you didn't like this video, hit that thumbs down button. I mean, whatever. If you don't like it, that's, that's good too. Um, hope you guys are enjoying your summer. Safe travels, everyone. And thanks again for watching another video on The Long Life. Have a nice day.